be honest. You're a mess. You say, you don't know me. No, but I know me. And I'm a mess. And for years I thought that what I had to do was to cover up my mess. Because if anybody ever found out I was a mess, I'm the preacher. How can I be a mess? Listen, listen again to David's words. Blessed is the one whose transgressions are forgiven, whose sins are covered. Blessed is the one whose sins the Lord doesn't count against him because in his spirit is no deceit. David isn't saying blessed is the person who doesn't sin, but blessed is the person who doesn't lie about it and whose sin is not masked by them, but covered by the grace of God. Check out the new series on praiseandharmony.tv called Come to the Table by Dr. John Mark Hicks. The gospel invites all to the table. The gospel doesn't make a division between rich and poor, slave and free, male and female, black and white, Jew and Gentile. The gospel doesn't make those kind of divisions. The gospel unites at the table, and the table is the experience of communion between the rich and the poor, and between the Jew and the Gentile, between the male and the female. In this eight-part study, you'll grow from in-depth lessons about communion. This series comes with PDF study guides and materials for small group leaders or families to use to help facilitate a more meaningful time of learning. I like the way Luther put it. When I am afflicted and a Satan is assaulting me, I don't run away from the table. I run to the table. Because this is a table of mercy. See, God is doing something at this table. I know we don't typically think about it that way. We tend to think about, what am I doing? I'm remembering, I'm proclaiming, I'm eating. But we need to think about what God is doing at this table. Come to the table. Available now at praiseandharmony.tv.